G'day, Brett here. Now, while doing some checks on my vehicle, I discovered my mud flap has begun tearing through. So I'm going to do some repairs with some cable ties I always carry and a cordless drill. Now I find it's funny that the uh, original Land Rover mud flaps lasted something 20, like 21 years. These ones I put on are probably eight or nine months ago and already it's tearing through. So it's a bit disappointing with the, the uh, modern day quality of some parts. But anyways, I've got uh, some cable ties. I recommend you carry some cable ties of different, different lengths. They can be useful for tying up wires out of the way of moving parts, for doing odd repair jobs like this, and just strapping things together tight when you need to. And also a cordless drill is pretty useful. This is just a small one, but uh, I can drill holes up to about 10 millimeters with this and the correct drill bits. If you get a bigger industrial size one, then certainly your uh, options are much greater with what you can do for repairing. But uh, I can use this to uh, drill new holes, put new bolts and nuts through if I lose a few nuts and bolts. Uh, and just other odd, odd repair jobs like this. So I've got all the kit on board, like the battery charges and that. I can use a 240 volt inverter to charge the batteries wherever I am. So I'm always topped up, ready to go. So uh, the last mud flaps I had, I actually did do some repairs on them as well. I just simply drill a hole through the mud flap somewhere get a cable tie, feed it through, strap it up, and that keeps it um, up and stops it from tearing all the way through and disappearing on the road somewhere. So I'll do that now. And there you go, a two minute repair job. I've still got a mud flap. Don't have to uh, go out and spend more money to re replace it again now. That should keep it going for plenty of years. Even if it does tear all the way through, I'll just keep adding new uh, cable ties to keep it on, on the car. So it pays just to carry a few extra little things, at least to carry some cable ties with you. Something like a cordless drill. If you're going more remote places, then yeah, it certainly helps. Um, you <laughs> If you ever try drilling a hole without a drill, it's, it's you know, near, near impossible. I've tried files and stuff and trying to enlarge little bits like that, but this uh, makes it a really quick job. So, until uh, next time.